Yeah, I got some things done up in here, man. For those who don't know, there's been a lot going on with the stuff going on in my apartment as far as getting repairs done and stuff like that. So what needed to happen now was for me to clear out as much space so that they could replace the carpet, which is going to be done on Monday. Today's Saturday, so I didn't want to wait until the last minute to start moving things. So I cleared up this area, cleared off what I need to clear off so that I can have as little to do Sunday night, Monday morning as possible. Because it's going to be a headache moving this bed into some place. So what I did was create a space in here by letting go of some stuff that should have been thrown away a long time ago. And also, uh, this allowed me to throw away some old tax stuff that I had been hoarding for no reason. Spring cleaning for real. This is like the most springiest cleaning I've ever done in my life. But it's uh, it's more than necessary and um, new beginnings, man. So, you know, I didn't get a chance to create as much space as I'd like to. Some of this stuff just can't necessarily be thrown away although some of it I'm holding on to for uh, for reasons that don't really probably even make any sense anymore like these chairs for example <laughs> I, I don't have a lot of chairs in this house but I also don't have a lot of people coming through so it probably makes sense to either sell or give those away but I figured if someone does come through if I do have people over it's better to have too many chairs than too few and right now I have too few without those so I just kind of think like that, um, but all in all, this little bit of the apartment is uh, going to go through its little renovation. They got to get to the windows, they got to do the carpet, they got to do some more stuff in the bathroom, so I'm just happy this is happening now because, yuck, you know I look like that, because, um, you know, it, it this was a depression session for me these past six, eight to eight months, almost a year. And I'm pretty much come out of it. So for this to be happening now is about as good as it needed to be, you know. Any other time I wouldn't be responding to this as calmly and as well as I'm doing. But right now, I'm, I'm fine. This is exactly what I feel like doing. This is stuff that should have been done. These are things that I would have did if I wasn't depressed. So it's like, since it's being forced upon me, you know, change. They say if you don't choose it, it will come to you. So that's what's happening right now. Um, and this is the beginning of it, I'm sure. There's a lot of change coming my way. But I, I'm more than ready to throw away just about everything in this house. Anything that you've seen, um, with the exception of those chairs, I'm pretty much ready to part ways with, to be honest. Um, I just want a lot of new stuff. I've, I've sacrificed a great deal without buying new stuff for, for reasons that you guys already know about. And I just feel like organically, naturally, uh, things are starting to just happen so that I can start getting rid of some stuff that should have been thrown away. Uh, and that's how it usually goes in my life, too. It's never me saying, okay, let me just wake up this morning and choose to do this, this, this. No, it's usually circumstances come and then, all right, now you can address some things that you ain't been... So that's what's happening. That's what's happening. And I'm having a good time doing it, believe it or not. If you're sensing any concern on my face, it's it's not the same type of concern that it's been um, in terms of like my money situation and all that other stuff I've been struggling with. That's not it. If you sense any concern, it's just a natural, um, you know, questioning of whether or not, um, you know, I'm going to be able to plan this out properly so that all my stuff can stay intact. Uh, what I'm most thinking about is that bed. You know, it's obviously been sitting in one spot for a long time. <laughs> and, you know, even though you rearrange uh, the bed to a degree, you, you know, flip the, the, the flip it around or whatever. When it comes to that box spring, it's been on the floor like that for as long as I've been here. I ain't moved it, so I don't want to deal with it. It was a headache putting it together. And it's going to be uh, a headache if I'm forced to, to take it apart. So if I'm worried about anything, it's a little problem like that, which I'm so very thankful for. Because if you were watching my therapy session videos from about a month ago, you know I had real concerns <laughs> that would otherwise put worry on my face. But right now, no, it's more about just executing what I need to do. You know, the one thing I, I used to, you know, take a look at it and pay attention to was just when, when it's time to move or when it's time to, to rearrange. In this case, I'm not moving, but 
uh, might as well be, given the fact that I have to clear out my entire living room. Uh, when situations like that, are people prepared? Or do they wait until the last minute and, you know, leave leave all that there is to do for everyone who's helping? I don't want to be that guy. You know, I know that I got somebody who's going to help me kind of move this stuff around. And I want it to be as simple as possible for us to just pick up big stuff and, and, and that would be that. Because little tedious little things are what takes the time. You know, you have to pick up people's little trinkets and boxes and stuff like that. You don't want to do that. You know, movers, people who want to come in and help you move, all they really want to do is pick up the heavy stuff. <laughs> the stuff that is tangible, boxes, stuff that they have to squat down on their knees and lift. That's what moving is. If I got to continue to pick up pins and pencils and, and grab that little shirt and that... Nah, drive us crazy so given the fact that i know i got some some tricky stuff to move to move around uh particularly these these big box springs and these two beds um i just want to create as much space as possible and get as much off the carpet as possible so that we can just get that done so yeah man i wanted to do me a therapy session today i think if i can say anything i'm very proud of how i've handled what's coming my way i like that it's distracted me from uh, what I had been kind of thinking about, which was basically doing nothing and kind of sitting in a, a lull, smoking my weed and not being uh, productive as I'd like to be, um, and not addressing certain things. And then it put me in a position to where I have to. Now I'm throwing stuff away, I'm cleaning, I'm, I'm moving around. And not only that, but I've been working out a lot lately, like pushing my body since I snapped out of that, that downward spiral. Um, kind of turn myself back into someone who wants to lift a little more. So given that all of this is happening after I've been pushing my body for the last three weeks, <laughs> it's like, oh, okay, now I guess I can see what I was preparing for, you know, because this happened about a month and a half ago and I had to move all this stuff and push all that stuff. I wouldn't have been up for it. In fact, I was feeling sick a lot of that time, to be honest with you. That's what's so ironic about it. I had been sick um, pretty much during, you know, the last, I'd say most of the end of January early February I wasn't I didn't have any energy I felt like I had COVID basically uh, but I'm 100% now I feel about as strong as I felt in almost a year and now we got a lot of lugging and pushing to do so I'm just thankful how everything has fallen into place I'm thankful that I don't feel like I did I'm thankful I got help from my family kind of make me feel better about my financial situation and um, you know now it's just about handling what's in front of me and um, yeah yeah that's that, man. I made another playlist last night. I, once again, I tell everybody, check out my Apple Music stuff, BDF. It's over, over a 500 playlist now. We got plenty there. Um, and I think it's, it's really good stuff. And my, my stuff on uh, this, this arts, I don't know what to do with this. Some of these pieces I think are really, really bad. Others I think are, are, are pretty damn good. Um, so, yeah. I'm definitely starting to discover my identity in art and it's it's like one of those things where you're like, oh, wow, I didn't know I was capable of this. You live this long on this earth and you don't try certain things. And then when you do, you find out that you like what you see. And that's exactly what's happening there. So, yeah, it is what it is, man. It is what it is. I'm, I'm enjoying myself today, though, over, overall with all that has to be done. I'm enjoying it. I'm taking it in stride. I'm liking throwing away stuff. I'm going through pictures and finding pictures of my mom and family members and friends and stuff like that that I ain't seen in a while. I found a jacket. A Laker jacket at that that I ain't seen since I moved here because it was stuck in a suitcase that I never opened up um, along with some other stuff that I used to wear all the time so that's what spring cleaning does it reminds you uh, that not only certain things need to be thrown away but certain stuff you forgot you had you'll find so yeah man that's what it is spring cleaning out with the old in with the new I hope you all are enjoying yourselves uh, I'll be getting back to you with Laker stuff of course as as time permits because I to be honest with you with this next game I don't know how I'm going to do that. I don't know. I might actually not be available to give you the update, depending on how things go throughout that day. Uh, but I got to check the schedules and see, because I know Monday, all of this has to take place. And I'm up early, like real early, probably about 5.30 to assure that uh, we can have this cleared out so that they can start working, I think, by 8 o'clock. And if they're working by 8, I'm hopeful they can put, I don't know how long it takes to put carpet down. I don't know what all needs to be done, but I'm hopeful they'll be done by noon. And if that's the case, I can get everything in the house by two. Cause it's going to take, I don't, I don't think it's going to take that long to put most of this stuff back in the house. Um, and just arrange it as I feel like it, you know, 
just like you do when you move. So, yeah, man, that's what it is. Um, I hope everybody's, once again, having a great day. My name is BDL44. Thank you all for watching. I'm out.